Question 3. Class 6 collect litter from a park. This chart shows some of the litter they have collected so far. So we've got bottles, cans and bags. And then we've got little pictures. The fact that we've got little pictures to represent how much litter they've collected means it's a special kind of diagram. And that special kind of diagram is called a pictogram. Now then, question number one says, how many bottles of class six collected? Now what you definitely don't do is just count the bottles here and say that's one bottle, two bottles, three bottles, four bottles, four and a half. That's not right. What you've got to make sure you do in any pictogram is look at the key because the key tells you how many each picture is worth. Okay, so each bottle is worth 100 bottles. Each can is worth 100 cans. Each bag is worth 100 bags. So if each bottle is worth 100 bottles, this first bottle is worth 100, second bottle is worth 100, third bottle is 100, each bottle is worth 100. So if a full bottle is worth 100, this one on the end is half a bottle. So half of 100 is 50. So that's worth 50. Do not be scared of just writing on top of the pictogram. It will really help you see what the answer's got to be. So all we've got to do now is count up the bottles. We've got 100, 100, 100, 150. So that adds up to 450, which is the answer for the first part of the question. If we scroll down, the second part of the question says, how many more bags than cans have they collected? So we're going to need to know how many bags that they've collected and how many cans that they've collected, first of all. So let's find that. Well, cans, again, each can is worth 100 cans. It says so in the key. So that's 100, that's 100, that's 100. And they are full cans, so that's nice and easy. So cans is 300 cans. So I'm just going to write that above my cans. Now I need to do exactly the same for bags. Bags, again, if you look at the key, each bag's 100. So that's 100, that's 100, that's 100, that's 100. Now the thing with this last one is that this is not a full bag. And actually, it's not even half a bag. It's one little square, so that's a quarter of a bag. So we're actually this time looking for a quarter of 100. Quarter of 100, half it is 50. Half it again to get a quarter is 25, so that's actually worth 25. Definitely not 50, 25, it's a quarter. So count up your bags, you've got 100, 200, 300, 400, and 25. So the bags is 425. But what we've actually been asked to do is find how many more bags than cans we've collected. So how many more is 425 than 300? Well, some of you can do this in your head and just work it out and say, well, that's straight away, that's 125. If you're not sure, any how many more question than something else is just do a simple subtraction. Find the difference between 425 and 300. Quick column method. 5 take 0 is 5. 2 take 0 is 2. 4 take 3 is 1. And there we have it. It's 125. And that's the question done.